So interesting question we have here. We've got 0.1 something divided by 0.02 something. So probably a good idea is to just expand that fraction by a factor of, I don't know, let's say 100. So instead of 0.1 something, we'd have 10, the, the, the 0 0.1 turns into 10, and that x would turn into a units digit of x, so it would be 10 plus x. So that's our numerator, 10 plus x. And then the denominator, when we expand by a factor of 100, we'd get, uh, instead of 0.02y, we'd have essentially 2.y. And y is some digit, non-zero digit, all right? So anywhere between 2.1 and 2.9, that's our denominator. So again, our numerator is something in the teens, right? Between 11 and 19. And the denominator is between 2.1 and 2.9. Now the question is asking about the closest integer to the greatest possible value of that ratio. So how do we maximize the value of a ratio in general? We would make the numerator as large as possible and make the denominator as small as possible. So in this case, the numerator, we'd, we'd consider that as 19 and the denominator as 2.1. So 19 divided by 2.1, I'm gonna to have to approximate a little bit there. I know that 19 divided by two is nine and a half, but we're dividing by 2.1. So the answer would be a little bit less than nine and a half. So that's closer to nine than it is to 10. That's for sure. And those are two possible answer choices. So, so it's not gonna be 10. And the next answer below nine would be six. There's no way it's that low. So I would go with nine and move on to the next question. If you found this video useful, go to quantreasoning.com for a lot more where that came from. You should also click that like button and let me know in the comments below what you'd like me to make future videos about. And of course, if you haven't yet subscribed, go ahead and do that and click that bell below so you get notified about future videos. See you next time.